Hey guys. <laughs> you know, like when. So I was gonna have a session tonight, but now I'm just home after rehearsals. So I'm like, let me talk to you guys because I miss you all. I don't really have much to do right now. I just wanted to get on live because I just wanted to talk to y'all. There's a lot of um, exciting things. I'm just not even going to talk. I'm not going to talk about that part. But just I'm... I'm happy right now. I'm very happy right now. And then I saw, hold on, I got to talk about something. I'll tell you what was really funny. I, I did like some interview thing. And the question was like, would you rather date someone 10 years younger or 10 years older? And I said 10 years older. And I was like, I prefer dating someone older because like I want to challenge. Like, I want to learn some stuff, you know, blah, 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 blah. So then it just kind of made me laugh because I'm <laughs> seeing And yeah, but right now I'm like purely focused on myself. It's like every day has been go, 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 go. And it's like, it'd be nice to have somebody right now, but it's like, I don't think that's in the cards and my schedule in the books or anything right now. You know what I mean? But... It's like my heart feels so warm because there's some, you know, I'm just not, I'm not going to say nothing. Just, just wait and see. Um, but yeah, so <laughs> I just got on here with really nothing to say, but I just wanted to say I love you guys and to just fasten your seatbelts. And yeah, I did like a little face beat tonight. It was very, very light. I did like a little concealer and I did a little bit of like the blush and it's like, I like it. I like it a lot. Uh, but yeah, but are you guys good? Are you happy? I'm in Atlanta right now for you all who don't know, I'm filming a movie and I'm really happy. I have my own spot, all of that. So I'm good. <sighs> It's nice, right? It's like mine for the for a couple months. So I'm really happy. You think the face is B? I got my lashes done here in Atlanta and I'm like obsessed. I really like them. Oh, but yes, blessings on blessings. And you know something else I learned? I've been learning this past few months. It's been a struggle, but I'm learning not to give two Fs. And I'm learning like in life, you can't give energy to certain things. Like if there's something or a situation stressing you out, you just got to let it go and let it be. Because it's like me, I don't know if it's my Virgo rising I don't know if it's because I'm a cancer. I don't know what it is, but it's like I will sit there and overanalyze the situation and be like, oh, man, and I will let it control how I'm feeling in my day. And so for like the past, like maybe a month and a half, I was like kind of like in a low like place, if I'm being honest. And it was like. One, I was trying to find like my confidence with like myself and my music and everything. And then on top of that, there were like other personal things that I was going through at the same time. And I still am. And it's like, it's really hard to try to put your best foot forward and be your best self on the outside to people when you're going through so much behind closed doors. And it's like, it's not an excuse to be like, <laughs> it's not an excuse to be like oh I'm down in the dumps blah 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 because we're all going through shit so it would be selfish of me to be like oh I'm the only one who's allowed to feel this way because all of us are going through something and it's like we're some people are just better at hiding it but the past like month or two months I don't know if you could tell from my tweets I was kind of like 
Ooh, you know, but now I'm like coming out of it and I'm learning that it's okay to not give your energy to certain situations and be like, you know what? Fuck it. It's okay. I can love that situation or that thing from afar. And sometimes you just got to protect your energy in yourself. I don't smoke. I, I don't. So it's like, <laughs> I don't really have like a vice per se to put those feelings out except for music and sometimes you just gotta learn to let shit go so that's what I'm learning and then at the same time I've been really busy so I'm really happy but I just wanted to get on there and say that and it's okay to not be a thousand percent okay all the time I don't have any tea to spill or anything but I just wanted you guys to know that you all aren't alone we're all going through it at the same time mental health is so important and yeah, pray, meditate, work out. I haven't really been working out the past week or two because everything's been so hectic and busy, but I can't let that be an excuse because usually when I work out, I feel a lot better or when I box, I like get that aggression out. But right now it's just been music and everything, but I'm feeling like a lot better. So I, okay, you guys like my gold chrome nails? But everyone who's kind of sensed it and felt it from like my tweets or whatever, I appreciate you guys and I love you and I'm good and there's really exciting things coming and there's going to be a lot of things paying off and it's going to be really exciting. So I love you all. Oh, and thanks for selling out my hot sauce. What? The hot sauce was, uh, was out for like less than an hour and it sold out. I did this collab with DoorDash and you guys sold it out. I didn't think that would happen. <laughs> but if I could be honest, it's really fun freaking good it's really good i love spicy foods i love hot sauce and it's like if even if my face wasn't on it even if i had nothing to do with it i would eat the hot sauce so whoever got it you're in for a treat and then i want you all to do like a taste test and then be honest and tell me if you really like it but i fuck with it i fuck with it okay anyways i am going to go back to do what i was doing but i love you all stay safe take care of yourselves when's the single coming All right. Peace out. A town down. Put yourselves first. It's harder than it looks. It's really hard, but we have to do it, guys. We're going to do it together. You use the hot sauce as a moisturizer? Come on, baby. No. Mm -mm. Don't let that burn on you. No, no, no. All right. Love you guys. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.